e minus 2x plus c. Minus cos 3x by 2 e power minus 2x upon 2 minus minus plus 3 by 4 sin 3x into e minus 2x minus minus plus and minus 3 into 3 9 by 4 integral of cos 3x e power minus 2x ds. This is the same integral which we are solving. So it is i1 when it goes on another side it becomes 1 plus 9 by 4 i1 is equals to minus cos 3x into e minus 2x upon 2 plus 3 by 4 sin 3x into e power minus 2x plus c. 4 plus 9 is 13 by 4. So 4 by 13 minus cos 3x e minus 2x by 2 plus 3 by 4 sin 3x into e minus 2x plus c.
1. Now, integrating factor p dx p is 1 now. Integral of 1 is x. Now, y into integrating factor is equals to integral of q into integrating factor plus c. Separate these integrals. Apply integral by pass on the first term because we have derivative of cos here so one term will get cancelled. First function as it is integral of second minus integral of derivative of cos minus sine integral of ex dx minus sine x ex dx plus c minus minus plus this and this term will get cancelled so we get y into ex plus c or y is equals to cos of x plus c into e power minus x. Plus 
dx plus c by taking algebraic function as the first function and trigonometric function as second xy is equals to first function as it is integral of cos minus integral of derivative of first derivative of x is 1 integral of cos is sin x dx plus integral of sin x dx plus c so y is equals to sin x plus c upon x sin x plus c upon x Now the next one is dy upon dx. Solve the differential equation dy upon dx plus x into sin 2y. x is into sin 2y is equal to x cube cos square y. Now here we didn't have y. We have the
So we get the integrating factor as 1 plus sine x. Now y into integrating factor is equal to q into integrating factor dx plus c. 1 plus sine x will get cancelled. y into 1 plus sine x. Integral of x is x square by 2 plus c. Or we can write it as y is equal to minus x square plus 2c upon 2 into 1 plus 